PhilHope now makes it easier for aspiring members to apply online and here's how. Step 1, you go to the browser or you browser you use. Mine is Google. So, visit the PhilHealth website by typing www.philhealth.gov.ph or else you can also visit PhilHealth electronic registration system at https colon double slash a register dot philhealth dot gov dot ph so pwede din din yan yun ang ilalagay mo or ita type so you're here in the website of philhealth so you click the online services at the top so makita mo siya dyan then after that no window will pop up so you click the e register link in the electronic registration section under membership so may makita ka dyan membership then the e-registration yan yung i-click nyo po after clicking the register so new window will pop up here uh, it just only says that this window or this facility online is for the registration of members in the informal and informal sectors so, yun. so after that uh, you click proceed so here and then new window again you should read first the terms and conditions before you click the accept clicking accept so the form will appear so you should fill up the forms the forms are uh, indicated the personal information contact details address Dependence information, guardian information, membership category, information, and upload document. Note, single individuals may list the name of their parents who are age 60 years or older as dependents. So married individuals may list their spouse and their children also as dependents. Next is to upload supporting documents. So you select there below uh, what kind of documents you going to upload or choose to file there so you can upload the documents such as birth certificate passport or driver's license so before that you must scan these first documents and save as jpeg png gif or pdf type yan lang po yung ina accept so the, then upload one by one that review all informations before proceeding for verifications and security purposes Enter the CAPTCHA code, so there is a CAPTCHA code, then you put it in the box, then refresh it if not legible. After that, tick the check box to confirm that all information entered are correct and accurate. Then after this, click submit registrations. And you're done! Just wait for the confirmation email upon completions of the registration. So your PhilHealth number will also be sent to you. So make sure that you, the email you give or you filled up is the right one. This is the email look like. You just click the link to activate your number. That's it for the online registrations for the PhilHealth ID number. And now we're going to discuss also the manual applications on how to apply it. Just go to the nearest Fell Health branch. So yun, the problem lang is uh, usually dami pong tao na pumupunta or pila. So you need lang talaga patience. Anyway, mas maganda kung maaga kayong napunta kasi mas lesser pa yung tao. You just need to fill out the two copies of the Fell Health member registration form that's the PMRF so kailangan mo siyang fill up before you fill up please read instructions at the back before filling out this form so you need lang all information should be written in uppercase or capital letters and it all information that's not applicable write in A uh, all fields are mandatory unless indicated as optional so by affixing your signature, you certify the truthfulness and accuracy of all informations provided. So put your member last name, 
first name and the middle name, then the mother's maiden name, then the spouse if you are married, then the date of birth, place of birth, then the, the sex, the civil status, the citizenships, then the tax identification number, then the address. So, if same naman yung permanent address, no? So, just click the permanent address. Then, the dependents. So, let me yung dependents. At the back, you sign it the overprinted name and put the date this pmrf also downloadable and the pill health website you just down it down after fill up the forms so you need to have two valid ids and also the following documents so if you are sss pensioners you also have to comply these documents and if you are gss gsis pensioners Ganun din. And, and, also, and also the uniform personnel of EFP, PNP, and the BGMP and BFP. So, may mga requirements din na documents na dapat isubmit para po sa inyo para makabil kayo dun sa PhilHealth application number or maging member po ng PhilHealth. Kasi ito po ay pang lifetime members. So, once na okay naman po lahat ng documents and the IDs and the form, you just wait the number na itatawagin kayo para po ma-entertain kayo sa uh, fail help ng mga officers sa front. Then, you just wait na lang kasi after na ma-enter yung mga details dun sa system, makukuha din yung agad yung MDR or the member data record at the same time yung fail help ID card. So, before you leave, so dapat double check nyo po muna yung mga record or nakasulat sa member data record especially sa, sa ID ng PhilHealth. So, that's all. Kayo na po parang mag-select or online or manual registration kayo. Thank you for watching!